Hi everyone! In today's episode, we are going to talk about a way of uh, formulating your sentences, well, in LSF, so your signs, a way of signing in LSF. In LSF, we can syntax our sentences in the same way as orally. It wouldn't make sense. It would be too complicated and too long to sign each word in the same order as uh, as orally. As you saw in the title of the video, this method is called the proform. I will try to explain this method with my own words. To keep it simple, uh, a proform is a way to express the most by signing the least. There's no better way for me to explain this to you than using examples. So here we are. I will use the example of someone using a train. So here's the story. A man wants to go to another town, so he has to take a train. He arrives at the train station and gets on his train. That's the plot. To sign this, you can use the proform of a person walking. That is the proform. And just so you know, uh, this sign uh, can work with a person walking. If you want to talk about an elephant that is walking, you are going to use this because you you change the the form of uh, the foot of the image that you're using. A man, little foot, walking. An elephant, walking. So the man is walking towards the train station. This is not only a proform, it means walking, but it becomes a proform when you're using it to describe other, other ways of walking, like an elephant or a man. So to sign this sentence, it would become a man is walking towards the train station. So now we want to express the fact that the man is entering his train. But we are not going to sign it like that. The man is entering his train. No, it would be too long, too, too complicated uh, um, and too literal, you know, too oral. But we are not in the oral language. So we are going to sign it like that. The man is entering his train. It's as simple as that. The flat hand represents the train. We already know that we are in a train station. And we already know that we are talking about a man who wants to take his train. So the man, this is the pro form representing the man. A person, here the man, is entering his train and he's sitting down, for example. It's a complicated subject, but it's actually a way to facilitate communication in LSF. And there are so many pro forms that it would be impossible for me to teach you all of them in one video. Actually, pro forms can vary depending on the situation you want to express. So a pro form can have several meanings depending on the situation, like the proform of the train, which can become uh, the proform of a bus, depending on the situation that you are uh, expressing. Thank you all for watching my video. Please subscribe if you want more and see you soon. Bye.